Hey guys, if you're looking to root your Samsung Galaxy S6, which was updated to official Nougat, I can make the dream come true. But let's do stuff in order. First, let me show you this phone is running the official Nougat version. There you go, Android version is 7.0. Next, using the Root Checker Basic app, which I encourage you to download from Play Store, let's see if the phone's currently rooted. And you see it isn't. Also, let me quickly turn the phone off and boot to recovery, just to show you everything is currently stock, there is no custom recovery installed. Once we've shown everything is stock, let's make some changes to that. We're gonna use Odin to flash TWRP recovery onto the phone. Odin and TWRP recovery files can easily be found on the internet, just do a Google search and download them. Boot your phone to download mode using the volume down, home and power button combo. Confirm by pressing volume up and connect the phone to your computer. Allow it to install drivers if that's needed. Now you can open Odin, and if everything is ok with the connection to the phone, the first cell in Odin should light up in blue. Then click on AP and browse to the place you've stored the TWRP tar file. Select it and click start. Flashing of TWRP is over in a flash and the phone should reboot. Now we have TWRP installed, we're gonna use it to flash the Magisk zip file. The easiest way to download the Magisk zip file is to install Magisk Manager app from the Play Store. You can see it here. When you open it, you should see two messages saying that Magisk is not installed and the phone is not rooted. Click on the first one and select Download. That will download the newest available file. It's now downloaded, here you see where it's stored. Now boot to your TWRP recovery by holding volume up, home and power buttons. Select install, find the Magisk zip file, select it and swipe to confirm flash. When it's done, we're basically done. Reboot the phone and check if root is acquired. We'll open Magisk Manager. Here it seems we've succeeded. But let's check using root checker again. Click verify root. Grant root access if prompted and see the result. I wasn't prompted to grant root access to root checker. You can see in super user settings in Magisk Manager that I've got two apps installed to which I've already granted root, root access permanently. And speaking of titanium backup, you can use that app if you've got problems with your Samsung account and recurring session expired messages. If that's happening to you or you can't even log in to your Samsung account, you can install Titanium Backup, search for Samsung account and select Wipe Data. Once you do that, you should be able to log into your Samsung account and use Samsung apps without any problems with expiring sessions or anything else. I hope this tutorial was helpful to you. If you liked it, stay subscribed for more stuff like this. As always, thanks for watching and until the next video, goodbye.